Hi everybody, I'm Xiaoxi. I'm a senior technology analyst from Mighty TechX. Now I'm going to walk you through some innovations uh, regarding interesting technologies. So here we can see there are several uh, different technologies of the monitor. Could you please introduce your technologies uh, one by one? So about the 3D monitor, so they have included the parallax barrier between the monitor above the LCD screen. So in order to look at the 3D, you just have to write, I mean, look at it from the angle, and then you find the spot, then you can start looking at the 3D motions. And then this is the LPD, uh, electric leakage protection device. Uh, yeah. <laughs> By adopting TPD device. Yeah, just um, the mic. Oh yeah. By adopting the TPT device, um, it avoids the electric shots, and then, uh, as you see, even though it's under the water, it still works outlets without any electric shots. So the display is in there. Yes. So they have this little um, modem in between this outlet. And then they're adopting. So even though, like, all if you look at it, the goldfish can still survive. So they're trying to put it in. Uh, I mean, adopt it into hair blow dryer or like refrigerator, or anything like that. That's a mobile version of the 3D monitor. So it's parallax barrier in the phone. Oh, yeah. Yes. So uh, is your parallax barrier special? Something? Is it the best in the market or? Uh, so far, yes. <laughs> it has yeah. been, uh, he has been working with LG before, yeah. back in the 2011. And then he invented this idea of the whole parallax barrier. And then he also provides the content of the uh, videos that goes into this 3D system. So invented the parallax barrier? Mm -hmm. He did. So, it's the technology that was used in the Nintendo Nintendo DS, right? 3DS? It could if they uh, okay. adopt the yeah? uh, parallax barrier yeah? between that. And uh, so it's glasses free 3D? Yeah. Yes. Glasses free 3D. Mm -hmm. And this. Right now, this is the one that it made. It's 3D, and then off the screen, it will be 2D. And then once you turn it on, it just becomes 3D. All right. Uh, so, what's the market? What's the market? Uh, it's the market from uh, targeting for POP and the extra monitor. For the bigger ones, they're shooting for the medical or anything that's helpful for the kids, like kids' shows. All right. So, how does it look? <laughs> yeah, that's Sorry. amazing. I hope you can see the video. <laughs> <laughs> So it's, it's impossible to capture the 3D in one camera, right? But and they, uh, and they they probably it's hard to camera to catch the 3D, but you have to you can clearly see with your eyes. So the parallax barrier is like a lens. Oh uh, yes, it's a little different than lens. So you have this this is LCD, and then on top of it, this is the parallax barrier. And then you just put it all together. So it's like a layer. Yes, it is. So you can put on any display? Yes. So right now, even this smartphone that he showed to you, this is the prototype that he made. Uh, so this is not a regular device. All he did is putting in the barrier between the LCD and then the screen in order right. to work with the 3D. So at what stage is your technology? Sorry? At what stage is your what technology? What stage? Yeah, oh. so you're showing prototypes. Any plans on that? Yeah. that? So right now, smartphone and then 19 inches is a, a prototype. This one is already made with the screen. So he also uh, manufacture and produce from Korea, Seoul, in Seoul. Yeah. Cool. All right. Thank you.